Mega Man. Hey guys, and uh, welcome back to Mega Man Battle Network 3, the game that I've been putting on and off for damn near a year. Anyways, uh, if I remember correctly, in the last episode, we did the whole N1 Grand Prix thing, where we're on the news and whatnot with Gutsman freaking out, and, and like the whole whole little like stage game thing that they want us to do. Not not like stage game, but uh, thing they was doing to make us look uh, look good on the news for Proto Man, who uh, came in and swooped in. So I'm pretty sure now we make okay, yeah, because last part we got a data disc that we got to go take all the way to Scilab. You know, if I got half a mind from like whatever happens in like the first and second game, what does this door do? Oh. Yeah, from like the first and second game, I know that they usually say, uh, oh yeah, he's he's not in the office at the moment. You gotta come back later. At least I think this is the right area. Yeah, I think this is the guy who I talked to. Is it? Wait, let me. Okay, no, no, no. So this is in. No, but I'm at, I'm at Scilab, right? Okay, so no, 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 this is the lobby. I'm gonna have to remember how to play through this game all over again. I, I haven't touched games in a, I haven't touched this game in a minute. Okay, so this should be the right area. Let me talk to all these people. Scilab is funded by the government and private companies. The technology we create is used to make new products. Okay, good to know, good to know. How about you? You the person? Yeah, look at that. Ugh, I knew it. Anyways, Dr. Ikari is in a meeting with the officials just now. The package for him? I'd be glad to give him to him for you. Uh-huh, take the data disc. Okay, so now wait. Uh, uh, yeah, no, that, that is the usual. Well, uh, if you like what you watched, then, uh, enjoyed the episode. Oh! Okay, never mind, never mind. I was gonna make a, I was gonna make a joke about ending the part now, but, uh, never mind. Oh, hi there, Lan. Also, if I'm talking a little bit fast, I'm trying to get back into the, the speed of recording things. Which, uh, speaking of which, hold on. Okay, there we go. I'm feeling a little better. Alright, you brought me my data disk. Thanks. Yeah, I gave it to the researcher upstairs. Hey, what's Chad doing here? Scilab just held a joint meeting with the officials to discuss how to handle the annual influx of evil. See, I, I hate, I hate how long it takes, because... My brain runs on all cylinders, trying to read it, and it's just like, oh yeah, stop midway. You have evil viruses. We just happened to run into each other there. Oh yeah, I'm gonna be in the N1 Grand Prix tomorrow. Wow, the same Grand Prix that everyone in town's talking about. That's great. Oh, but unfortunately I have a meeting tomorrow. It doesn't look like I can go root for you. Sorry. Yeah, I know. I mean... If I had told you earlier, you'd just work yourself sick trying to make time to go, right? I'm sorry to make you worry about me so much, Lan. Here, I'll give you this to make up for me not being able to go. Uh, the N1 Grand Prix will be packed with fierce battles. Ugh, fierce battles, right? I'm gonna start ad-libbing, man. I can't do this no more. It wouldn't do if your PET broke again. Hooray! Oh wait, he gave me a case? Okay. If you put your PET in that, an elephant couldn't break it. Say, are you going to be in the N1 Grand Prix 2 shot? Yes. Is one of your parents coming to cheer you on? Oh yeah, no, I know he's sick. Seeing Lan and his dad get along, like, it's like, oh yeah, he can't show up, but uh, whew. At least he didn't say something like, what did he say? Like, losing is futile or like, never lose or something? I don't remember. Like, that's why he got the attitude. No, they won't be coming. Oh, well, anyway, I wish both of you the best of luck. Now then, I'd better get back to work. Wait, isn't his... Never mind. Chad, I won't be losing tomorrow. <laughs> I told you before, and I'll tell you again. You don't stand a chance. I'm going to win. If I were you, I'd just concentrate on trying to pass the first round. Damn, what are you so, what are you so root for? How many times have I beaten him now? We fight him in, we fight him in one and two. I'll probably beat him like three times. Maybe, mm, yeah, about that. What's his problem? Why's he always gotta be like that? He makes me so mad. Calm down, Lan. Shot is probably just on edge because of tomorrow. 
Let's head home and sleep early for the for the Grand Prix. Yeah, yeah, I know. I promise, though, I'm not losing to him. You know, it's always it's always head back home, go to sleep early, and everything like. How long is he? I, this recording has only been going on for five. Now we need to go. This recording has only been going on for five minutes. Honestly, I don't even remember how far I am in the game now I think about it. Because what? First boss was Flashman. Second one was... I don't even remember the... I don't even remember the second, like, main boss's name. Uh, you know, it'll, it'll come to me later. And we have Beastman. So there's definitely going to be a boss here, like... Is it normally, like, six? I don't remember. I don't remember. But yeah, I don't know how I don't know how close I am to beating this entire game, because uh I know as soon as I beat this game, Battle Network 4 is gonna take a minute. Since I'm also doing zero at the same time. Let me talk to Mama. Thank you, Lan. How was your father? He was good. Uh I just didn't want him to work himself to death and everything. You know? Gotta be a, gotta be a good sign. Get ready for bread. Save the events. Yeah, that's a quick start. Heike, I might just start cutting out random parts. Just to just so like the first part of the episode isn't always like I don't know, a little junky. Yeah, we'll see. The morning of the N1 Grand Prix Championships. Yo, get out of bed! I think I peeked my mic there. I gotta stop doing that. Lamb, wake up! It's morning! Oh, uh, five more minutes. <laughs> Today's the N1 Grand Prix. I'm gonna start. I'm just gonna start calling it the N1 tournament. I'm not gonna. I'm not about to say N1 Grand Prix over and over and over again. I'm shortening that shit down. <laughs> Damn, what you guys so heavy for? Oh, I almost overslept. You can at least try waking yourself up on a day like today. It's not that. I was so excited I had trouble falling asleep. That's real. That's real. That's real as hell. Yeah, well, anyway. Let's go win that tournament. Yeah. That's why we're in this. Wait. That's why we're in this in the first place. Okay, who? My, my brain just. Shut, stutter stepped for a, for a second. I was like, I was like, wait, did I read that right? Alright, come on. Let's go head over to the, <laughs> to the TV station where the Grand Prix will be held. The TV station was on Beach Street, right? Look out, world! Here we come! Land, you got mail! Alright. What's the button again? Is this plus? I keep hitting, like, X and everything. Like, my, my brain... When I forget, defaults to Star Force controls. Hey! Today is finally the N1! I'm in Block A, so my battle is pretty early. I'll go on ahead of you to the TV station. See you at the finals! Alright, bae. Ooh, I can't wait to mop the floor with you. I'll be watching you on TV. Good luck. And don't get hurt. I mean, I'm not the one getting hurt. You gotta worry about Mega Man, to be honest. You better go through the ringer. Okay, so yeah. So you're the kid from ACDC who will be in the N1. Okay, so yeah, I'm, I'm guessing like... Oh, I thought they were just gonna say, like, it's closed off. The N1 tour will soon depart. Please get ready, everyone. I'm not gonna talk to every single person there. Oh, okay. So the bus stop, bus stop ain't active. Oh, okay. We just we just get the beach pass. I was like, okay, is this where we start taking the bus and everything? Or hold on, hold on. I kind of like the music. Okay, I, I, I my my brain just didn't read that one out. You know, I thought there was gonna be something there, cause. Realistically, there's, there's probably been a lot of secret stuff that I haven't done in like Battle Network 1 and 2. Dude, I have something really cool from Natopia. Wanna buy it? You use it to modify the Navicus program. Pretty cool, huh? You can't usually get them in Electopia. We'll sell it to you for 5,600 zenny. I don't even know how much money I have, like... That's almost all my money. Hold on. 
is but it's like is he worth like is is he worth buying i like, i don't know i i don't know he i don't know he sells and i don't have enough i don't have enough money what does he say go down the hill and walk walk a ways to get to the end one bag is there like another shop that I can go to? I have not looked at my battle chips in. Oh, yeah, see, I, I should have read that one out too. Yeah, I have not looked at my battle chips in a minute. Like, genuinely, when I say. What is the secret here? No? But yeah, genuinely, when I say, like, I've probably forgotten how to play part of this game, I could definitely say I forgot how to play part of the game. So I hope I'm not super duper rusty. Is the TV station van? So I can. So what? I go over here? Yes, I do. At least I think this is. The... Hey, wait a minute. Who's the guy in the mask and the in cape? Who is he? Oh, this this guy? What the fuck? You look like you're from something. I can't tell. We're almost ready. Contestants should remain in the lobby. Okay, so I'm in the so I'm in the right place, right? Oh yeah, you're a you're a special character, I can tell. Thank you, school kid. You and the N1? Well, yes. Be good and go home before you get hurt. What? Where do you get off talking like that? You're not even that much older than me. Whatever. I'm already 13. Oh, this is, this kid 13, I'm giving him this deep ass voice because I thought that little swirl on his chin was a beard. You know what? Puberty. Whatever. I'm already 13 years old. Little kids these days don't have any manners at all. I'm Tora from Swapopolis. Is that what it says? Swapopolis. You know, I'll teach you some. That battle with Tora. Oh! Come on, then. They'll repeat a shreds. You know. Oh, it's one of these kind of enemies. You know, I'm gonna keep this whole fight in. But I might throw it at the end of the episode, depending on what happens later. Cause like I'm, I look at this guy and I'm I'm annoyed. I knew it. Oh my god! It's yeah. It's one of these ones where you gotta like super focus. God damn, bro. Yeah. Cause it's like you either you either got them slashing. Oh no, they dropped the So you okay, so I can't even hide behind him because he drops a ground wave. And these guys have long swords. This is this is so lame. You know, I probably shouldn't have done it right here, but I think that's okay. Actually, no, if I stay in the back row, I'm good, right? I don't think Guts Punch is going to be useful here, so yeah, I'll just spend the whole turn. Yeah, no, because he's... I swear to... Huh? Yo, nah. So yeah, he, he pretty much says, stop hiding on the back row and fight me. See, I hate these, I hate these kind of bosses because like, what do, what do I, like, what do I, well, I mean, I know what I need to do. It's more like, <sighs> damn. And like, I know that I shouldn't have, oh, oh, you can actually, what? Brother, this ain't fair. This ain't fair. I can't move. I can't move. I'm stuck. I lose. It, it, it doesn't even it doesn't even matter what I do. Like I, I lose. You know, honestly, that's what I get for hiding in the back row. I'm I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, that's that's honestly what I get for hiding in the back row. My hands are up. <laughs> You're all hype. Go home now before you get hurt. He was so strong. So this is what the N1 is like? Is everyone here this strong? What are you whimpering about? The real battle lies ahead. Hey, 
I'm gonna pay you back later. Say whatever you want. Because if we do end up battling each other, you're gonna lose all over again. <laughs> okay, no, so that was... So I had to fight him. You know, a scene just flashed into my head. I didn't know it was this game. <laughs> Anyways. Welcome, N1 contestants. Sorry to keep you waiting. Now then, proceed inside through this entrance. Everyone in the stands is waiting for your arrival. Okay, so I gotta, I gotta win. I really do hate the gimmick bosses where they all got like platforms and st no, not even platforms. They all got a bunch of stuff in front of them, and it's like ah, I should have used, I should have like turned invisible more. Ah, this is it, Lan. Are you nervous? Not at all. I am. I'm warmed up now. That's one more person I won't let win. So then we just like focus on him for, for no reason after we like just saw him. Come on, let's go. We're gonna beat them all. Right. Let me uh let me just make sure to save real quick. There we go. Honestly, I really need like I'm thinking to myself like should I modify my folder a little bit or should I just leave things as is what do you say wow I can hear the tears from here I'm getting nervous so it's through here what about you hey samurai boy you in the end one too let's get it on it's not this door right yeah no no no, no. it's this it's further there we go Ladies and gentlemen, okay, wait, hold on. Before I even continue, am I gonna add a reverb to my voice for this? I might. Ladies and gentlemen, IPC Inc. presents the N1 Grand Prix. I'm glad they did that because I was not gonna add my own little fanfare. Thank you all for coming to witness this historic event. I am Suna, wait, I am Sunayama the producer of this show. Allow me to welcome you into, ah, uh, this is what I mean by my brain be firing on all cylinders. Allow me to welcome you in, in place of our sponsor, the president of IPC Inc. Our sponsor is observing the tournament from the editing room up there. So like, is he actually watching? Yeah, he is. You know, speaking of which, he kind of just like Evil Phoenix. I introduce, I introduce to you the D Block Net Battlers, who clear the prelims to, to buy, to buy. It, I didn't know that was a word. Prelims to vie for the crown of world's strongest battler. Yo, so who is that on the far right? Like you, you freaking me out, dog. First off. The super student who saved us all from the W3. The flawless operator of Mega Man. Lan! Yeah, you hit me with some cheers. Mm, yes, beautiful, beautiful. The grandmaster of disaster, who can read ahead a hundred moves and check you in one. Tora! Okay, no, he's got an animation too. He'll twist you with his bare hands. The powerhouse of D Block, the Iron Man of Yamland. Bonzu! Yeah, okay, he's flexing! Hailing from South Utopia, beautiful skin, slim physique, the sexiest net battle on the earth. I agree. Jennifer! Ooh, okay, he's too far with this is right. Born in Utopia, but raised in Yumland, using the technique of multiple count trees. Why'd I say it like that? The super inter the super intercultural battle battle blah 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 Johnson. It's so funny when you look at like the sprite work on them because they all have the same. Everything below their neck is literally the same, just differently colored. I don't know. It's <laughs> yeah. This is a little funny. It's not all about rare chips. Nothing is more important than your operating technique. Technical net battler extraordinaire, Koetsu. 
they all gave them unique animations too, so it's kind of funny. Like, those are just in the game. At first glance, he doesn't look like he knows much, but he knows everything there is to know about chips. Donning his Psylab outfit, the Maniac Net Battler, Yosh! I love the music from uh, on Titan. <laughs> Who is this guy? Age, gender, nationality unknown. The owner of a million mysteries. Net Battler Q. Oh, you you don't you don't do nothing you don't do nothing interesting. I like that. These are the eight who will compete in D Block. Let's give them all a warm round of applause. Yup, mm. yup. Clap for me. Clap for me. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Mr. Sunyama. In total, how many contestants are are taking part in the N1? There are four blocks from A to D, each with eight contestants. For a total of 32 people in all. Blocks A to C have already moved, have already moved to the battle arena. The battles will be broadcast live on this giant screen. The, the battle arena? This is where we'll battle? In order to battle here, you must first battle at the arena. In advance to the top four. Well then, what are you, <laughs> what are you waiting for? Show us the arena! I'm just itching the battle. Please be patient. We'll take you there in a moment. <laughs> we'll be watching to see how far you'll, your fighting spirit takes you. Shut up and show us the where to fight. There's a ferry in front of the TV station. They'll take you to the battle arena. Your battle arena will be none other than... Hades Isle! Now then. It's time to go, it's time to go to battle. Proceed to the Hades Ferry. Oh, whoa! Yeah, that's not what he said, but I don't know, oh, I don't know what else to say, man. Now then, everyone, enjoy the battles on this large, on this large screen monitor. It's pretty expensive. An opening ceremony full of unexpected twists. A mysterious island foreboding, foreboding calling, wait, forebodingly called Hades Isle. You won't believe what awaits our heroes on the ferry. You know, part of me feels like ending it there simply just cause like, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do in 10 minutes. So I, I think that that's fine as set up or something like, Kind of, kind of simple, easy episode. Not too much going on. A little, little calm. But uh, if you like what you watched, don't forget to uh, like, subscribe. You know, check out all the links in the description. If you want to watch, watch another video, God, no! If you want to watch another video of mine, like Mega Man Zero has been going up simultaneously. Like I have a bunch of uh, a bunch of other shit, you know. But uh, other than that, uh, yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Honestly, because of how I did this, I might just do a double upload where I upload this and then the next day I upload it regardless of, just regardless. But uh, yeah, hope y'all enjoyed and uh, bye!